I switched over to a slender spoon, put some wax worms on it, and uh, got a kind of a nice bluegill. Not a bad gill for Long Lake. Ice fishing is when I normally keep them out of here. This would be a, a decent eater. But for today, he gets to go back. And I'll see him again in probably January. treble hook. He had every one of them. Forgot how much more fun it is on an ultralight. <laughs> Not a bad gill. No. <coughs> mm, very warm. Yeah. I don't know about you, this is a lot more fun than fishing with bobber. <laughs> I saw that too. Isn't this more fun? Yeah. Oh, Jesus. I got hit like three times right there. This is fun. This is blast. Down there going, watch this. <laughs>
Here's some baggage. Jesus Christ. You have a lot of Another jig and wrap crappie. Easy to unhook. Nice, fun little fish. She likes jigging a jigging wrap like this during open water. Anybody that's going to watch this video, tell her she ought to try it on the ice. She'll love it. <laughs> no. There are chances that hits that editing room floor. <laughs> you know, I respect your fear of ice, but I just know that get over that you enjoy ice fishing so much no doubt in my mind It's not my fear of ice, it's the fear You're of falling under through. the ice. Just wearing that jacket, it's impossible for you to go under the ice. Combine that with the bib, you're gonna bob like a freaking cork. Hey guys, thanks for joining us on uh, another trip out to Long Lake. Uh, it was a very interesting uh, fishing trip because this time we started uh, throwing everything in the tackle box at them. And what, one thing we found that did work is uh, jigging wraps. We have never used jigging wraps in open water for crappies like this. And it was a blast. They were slamming them. I mean, they hit like a ton of bricks. It was fun. Uh, glad you guys joined us. Uh, remember, hit that like button. Hit that subscribe button. And until next time, thanks for watching Bushwhacker Outdoors. Thanks, guys.